Now over the years, I've sold about four million books showing people how to get government grants. That's right. I've been doing this work for a long time, about 30, 40 years, I think. <laughs> I'm an old guy. But I'm more excited now about what's going on in the internet. You know, I mean, it's to me a better source of free money than the government ever had or ever will be <laughs> and who knows what the government's going to be in the future so i'm trying to do now is educate people about the free money programs that are in the internet i mean this is changing you know our life uh, in so many ways i mean I, I call it like the new free money society you know and it's crowdfunding and peer-to-peer -peer and the share economy and, and all these kinds of things that are happening and it's not just you know uh, pie in the sky or whatever and a, a couple anecdotes no i, I I've interviewed like two, three hundred people who have actually gotten this money, you know, and, and because it's it's so different than going through government regulations or going through the bank and all these other traditional sources of money. Now here I, I made a list of 17 ways that using free money on the internet is better than getting a government grant or going to the bank or anything else that you think of uh, for a source of money. <laughs> okay, here's one. The first one, no credit checks. That's right. Could you imagine people giving you money with no credit checks? That's what it is. <laughs> that's, that, I think that's incredible. You know? So that's why you have to try this thing. There's no income requirements. See, on grants, there's sometimes income requirements. You can't make over a certain amount of money. Other grants, you have to make over a certain amount of money. It's all, you know, every program has different requirements. But here, there's no income requirements. They're going to never ask you how much money you make. They're never going to ask for your credit check. Also no complicated grant application. Now some grant applications are easy and some you could get a stack of <laughs> forms to fill out like this. Well here there's none of that stuff. It's all just a little like fill in the blanks on a website you know to get the money. Now here's an important thing. You don't have any partners, any investors, or any bankers telling you what to do. This is money. <laughs> you say you're gonna do this, and then you get the money, and then you just do it. Nobody else is you know, telling you step by step, or making you hire their girlfriend, or whatever it is, if they give you money to do something, or, uh, or take it back from you. you know, I mean, there's no partners, nobody else you, you have to get married to, you know, uh, like a venture capitalist, to get this. And also, you don't need an accountant, a lawyer, you know, or, or a grant writer, or any of these kinds of things. You know, that's right. All these professional people, you don't need professional people like that to apply for money on, on the web. So that's another thing. And also, you don't need any special expertise. You don't need a PhD in engineering or, a, or an MBA or, or any of these things. You just have to do what you're gonna say you're gonna do, you know, and that's what it's for, you know, and it's even to help other people, not only help yourself, you could use this money for. And here's another important thing. There's no limits to how much or how little you can ask for. So you can ask for a million dollars. That's right. People get a million dollars to this. Or you can just ask for a hundred dollars. That's right. So there's no income requirements. Like, you know, so many government programs, you have to ask. Oh, they're only going to give you a quarter of a million dollars. Or, or you can't ask more for than a thousand. Nah, there's none of that stuff. So it's up to you uh, on what are you going to ask. And also, I think one of the most important things about this, there's no downside. You know, applying for this money, <laughs> the worst is you fail and you learn so much by failing because you're starting to learn a new process in life, a new process on how to use the tools that are available in our society for you to get ahead in life, for you to contribute more to our society. And, and that's what, you know, and nobody's going to get angry at you if you fail. So like if you borrow money from your, you know, uh, banker or, <laughs> or friends or some investor, they're going to get real angry because you fail. Here, if you fail, it doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't get the money, big deal. Nobody cares. Yeah. Uh, also, you get the money in 60 days. Yeah. Sometimes even sooner. You know, I mean, that's incredible to me. So two months, you can start today. And in two months, you start getting that money. You know? I mean, it's, it's just remarkable how fast that this could work. You know, the government, you may have to wait till the next app application process you know they only accept applications in February <laughs> whatever it is or you have to wait till they ran out of money this year because uh, you know they gave it all away so you're gonna have to wait until the next fiscal year you know which is next November or whatever it is till they start handing out money there's none of that stuff you know, uh, here okay and what's interesting too about this you get the money so you have it to make your product 
you know, say like you have an idea to make a product. Okay, you go on the internet and you rate, get all the money to go make the product. So you don't even have to have the product yet. <laughs> and people are giving you the money <laughs> just to go make the product. Man, yeah, I mean, that's what's amazing. So, uh, so that's the, you, know, you can't get anywhere else. Okay, also, you have a better chance that your application will be successful. I mean, the real answer to this, it depends on, on the program, some for small grants, you know, uh, or actually for uh, stuff that they have to give you the money for in, in the government. Everybody applies, gets it, because they have to give it to, to you because you're eligible for it. And that's more of direct payments and not grants. Uh, but on grants, it could be, you know, like 20%, 10% of the people apply. I know one of the big ones for uh, businesses is about 20, 20 25% of the applications that are here, I mean, in the biggest site that's doing this is like 45% of the people apply. Other sites I've seen 80% of the people you know, who apply for the money get it. 80% you know, of sex rate. That's incredible to me. Okay, also, you get paid if you're providing products to a customer, you get paid for all those products you're going to send out before you even make them and send them out. <laughs> That's right. It's like, hey, I'm going to open up a store next week and have money and, and have products there, but you give me the money now. That's what people are doing. They're getting the money now before they open the store <laughs> and have the products to give out. I mean, that to me is never before it has been done. Also, what's interesting about this, by putting your, your product or, or project or whatever you need money for on the web, you, you wind up getting more publicity and more information and more distributors you know, than you would otherwise because this is a worldwide thing. So people all over the world say, hey, you're doing this in, in you know, Scranton, Pennsylvania? Hey, I'm over here in Dusseldorf, Germany, and I'd like to do that too. I'll be your distributor here in Germany. You know, and you get this kind of thing. So many people I talk to, you know, uh, are, 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 that's what's happening to them. Besides the money you get on, on the web, you're getting people all over the world that are going to spread your idea you know, and, and get money for you and they keep going and going and going forever. Uh, uh, also, what's neat about this is you have undeniable proof that you have a winning idea. See, you don't have to waste any money on market studies or surveys to see if it's a good idea or whatever, because you're going to the crowds, you know, and that's what it is. So most people, you know, traditional business, you had to go market survey. Hey, is this a legitimate thing people are going to buy? And you convince, <laughs> you know, you get data to convince yourself or somebody else that this is a, a viable product. Then you go to an investor or an uh, someone like that with money, a banker, and say, hey, this is going to be a viable product. Lend me the money or be my partner to do that. Here, you do that all in one shot. You put it on the web. You get customers who give you money ahead of time to make your product. And now you know for sure this is a great idea and it costs you nothing to do it. So why go through all this other stuff you have to go through in a traditional business when you can go right on the internet, get the customers get the money in one shot and then go make the damn thing <laughs> and have no partners you know and that's it's just terrific you know there, there, there's I think there's nothing more exciting in our country that's happening right now but this and this is just beginning people are gonna miss out you know if they don't start learning about it now also what you can get money for man it's just not business it's any kind of thing you can be a nonprofit an inventor or for your education or just to for pleasure <laughs> or you want to help yourself or help other people that are in trouble or whatever man that's why anything you could use this kind of money for and that's what's neat about it you know and, and the other neat thing that you could do with this that you can't do <laughs> in most of the other grant programs you could go back for money over and over and over again i've talked to people going up four four times go back hey i got thirty thousand this time hey go back got fifty thousand hey go back and get a hundred thousand you know that's what's kind of the so it's there, you know, you, you don't wear out your welcome, you know, and, and it, to me, another thing that is an indication, it's already bigger than some government grants. Right now, one of the big websites that do, uh, do this uh, money uh, crowdfunding gives out more money to artists than the National Endowments of the Arts, and that's our government 
office that gives grants to artists is promote artists. Now this website is giving out more money than the government for artists. <laughs> so, I mean, that's a clue. Something is happening here. And, and, and you got to take advantage of it or start learning about it. Even if you don't use it now, you have to learn about it. Because it's sort of like, you know, in the 90s, you know, about the internet. Man, look at what happened to the internet. And the people say, oh, it's complicated. It's this and that. And it took over our whole lives, you know. And that's it. And I feel this is another thing. Uh, I've been studying information for 30, 40 years now. And, and that's why I, uh, <laughs> my idea or, or, or my opinion is this is the next really big thing that's going to change our economy, change the world, change everything that's going on. And, and like I say, I, I've interviewed like 300 or so people already that use this money. If you want to see these interviews, you go to uh, YouTube. It's all for free. <laughs> I want to teach people about this for free. You go to youtube.com slash Matthew Lesko 70 because I was 70 when I started this. I'm now 71, but I'm going to be here for 20 more years. So you'll be seeing <laughs> videos about how people could get involved in this forever. Uh, and the kind of videos you're going to see there, let me tell you some people. Here's 27 people I set aside. These are people just like you. <laughs> Look for them uh, on the YouTube channel. They got free money that changed their lives. Like this fella here, he got $6,000 to make jelly in his basement. Now, who would ever think of that? Hey, where do I get six grand? Yes, you can. Or how about you can invest a little time and a few dollars, yeah, you know, I mean, a couple hundred bucks if that, and get $420,000 in 10 days. Where are you going to get $420,000 in 10 days? I mean, that, that's remarkable. Here, work part time, invest $11, $11 working part time and get 60, I mean, $89,000 in 30 days. Wow. How to get $16,000 on the internet <laughs> to do your own environmental project. Yeah, it's not just business, it's saving the world too. Or $5,000 interest-free loan. See, it's not only money, you can get loans too, but no interest right? <laughs> to, to start a fashion business. Or stop wasting money in the wall, mall, how to make stuff yourself. Or no matter what your age or background, get $45,000. That's right, I've seen teenagers that I've interviewed $45,000 in 30 days. Or how to make big money with your second job. You know, you have a, a current job. Now do this on the side. Get money and, and do something you really like to do. <laughs> or here, this fellow, he, he hated his job. <laughs> and he's he, going to work on Monday. He hated it so much. And now he got free internet money and solved that problem. Okay, here's a young college student with no money at all. And she starts a nonprofit to create jobs for the homeless. Can you imagine a college student going up to some foundation and asking him for, you know, tens of thousands of dollars because you want to create jobs for homeless. <laughs> you know, you have no experience. You can't do that. She did. And now she, she's so uh, good at this, you know, that, that, that CNN had made her this big celebrity because she's doing wonderful work doing this. You know, well, here's a guy who dropped out of college to count the money that he made on the internet. He, he, he was making so much money while still in school, he had to drop out because he's making too much money. Or here, here, here's a company that got 40 distributors. That's right. On the internet. For going after the free money, got free money too, but he also got the distributors. Or how about this? $2,000 working part-time in your basement writing jokes about your wife. Right. Now, where the heck are you going to get money to write jokes about your wife? This guy did it. <laughs> he went on the internet. Right. Okay. <laughs> here's, the, here's, here's somebody who, this guy quit his job and with 150 bucks, he got $350,000 on the internet. He hated his job, hated sitting in traffic. I, I think out in Las, uh, Vegas, I mean, Los Angeles or whatever. Or here's a guy who wanted to hang around a ski resort. So he got $15,000 to start a business that enabled him to live near the ski resort. Well, how about this family here? <laughs> this guy's funny as heck and his daughter's clever. Uh, they got half a million dollars, you know, from the internet to do a little app that he was working on for people, help people with their family photos. Or how about this, this guy and, and this woman, they traveled the world and got $16,000 to travel the world because they hated their jobs they were doing. See, that's something that you can do what you really want to do in life. And, and that's what's, you know, I, I think it's such a waste of resources and talent and everything in our society when people aren't doing what they want to do. And so then they're not contributing more for the rest of us. And, 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 and God, I think that it really helps our life. Each one of us, you know, not only a person changes their life, but everybody else in their life because you're so much happier. Here, here's create a high tech product when you have no tech background 
and get $50,000 on the internet. So you could do things you can't even pronounce <laughs> and just go out and get it. Yeah. Or here's, here's a great website. Uh, you get a nice monthly check as an artist to work on your video, your music, your writing, your artwork, any kind of art. Our college kids show how to get $60,000. These are college kids. One actually doesn't live far from here where I live. $60,000 for their idea. Uh, and here's a guy who, who wants to help with table scraps, you know, in common posting $26,000 you know there's a lot of money in table scraps you know or this woman here who's trying to help people drink beer better <laughs> and it's a clever idea and she got money on the internet for that or this young uh, couple of guys just out of college are turning bananas into flour and got $30,000 on it actually $35,000 or, or how about this woman here she started a nonprofit on the internet started with $350 that's it only $350. She's now collected $400,000. Man, how do we unlock more people with just 300 bucks in their pocket to go out and get $400,000 to solve problems in the world? That's what's going on in our life. We got a lot of problems in it. And each one of us, if we just take a problem, you know, and figure out how to get money to solve it, to help you solve it, and it's there now. Oh, here's another guy. Doesn't need a lot of expertise to get ninety thousand dollars on the internet. Just a lot of desire, and that's what it's all about. It's not easy. I mean, you don't go, you know, in ten minutes and get, you know, four hundred thousand dollars. No, you got to work, but it doesn't take investments. You know, it doesn't take money. It doesn't take some fat cat. It doesn't take knowing some gatekeeper and all that kind of stuff. It just takes you. How about a stay-at-home mom delivers her baby while at the same time getting twenty-five thousand dollars on the internet for a business idea? Now that's cool. Or here's a woman that loves to cook. Yeah, and what she did is got eleven thousand dollars. To write a cookbook. She started a blog, right? And then got eleven thousand and that cost, you know, hundred dollars or something to start a blog. And now, you know, on the internet, got eleven thousand dollars to have a real cookbook. Man, see, that's how you can change your life now and do things you really want to do in life. And if you're not going to use the videos on, on my videos on YouTube, that's YouTube slash um, Matthew Lesko 70. You know, here are the key words to keep looking out for if you're searching is crowdfunding, peer-to-peer. -peer, and the shared economy. So that's what's going in our new in our life. And uh, I think the more people learn about it, then you don't want to be the last person on the stage. It's sort of like being the last in line for a grant in the government. They ran out of money then, you know, so something else will be different. And the beginning of the wave is when all the excitement happens and when it's fun because nobody else is there and you take advantage of it and you, and you start on the wave. And that's a fun part of life being on the beginning, not on the end when it's trickling in the beach and there's no power left. So get out and use this stuff.